Take the glass. How do you do this? It's completely under my control. And the shapes magically float. Watch what happens when I concentrate on it. What's good? Welcome back to How To Magic. Oh, oh, magic! I am your host, Evan Era. In today's episode, five magic tricks you can do. So if you're ready, hit that thumbs up button for me and let's go. Okay, check it out. I have a drinking glass. Watch. Here's what you'll need to set this up. You're going to need two different size cups and you're gonna tape the two cups together like this and fill them with water. Once you have the cups taped up and filled with water, you're going to place them in the freezer and let them freeze overnight. You're then going to carefully remove the ice from the cup, just like this. And now you should have a perfectly formed cup made of ice. You can fill this with your favorite drink and then you're just gonna handle it like a normal glass. And then when you're ready to freak everyone out, all you do is take it and break off a piece of the ice with your teeth. And they're perfect for a telekinesis trick. They'll just melt across your counter just like that. It looks absolutely shocking, but it is completely harmless. You can chew up the ice and it will totally freak people out. Your audience will be none the wiser. Okay, if I have a really cool card trick to show you. So this is a really amazing one that you guys can do at home too, of course. As you can see, the cards are all in new deck order. It's a brand new deck of cards. They're all separated by suit mm -hmm. and they're all in order. Check this out, I'm gonna gather up the cards and I'm actually gonna have you do this part, okay? You know how to cut a deck of cards, right? You're just yeah. gonna take them and cut them in half like this, and then make sure you complete your cut all the way, okay? Cut it as many times as you want. Awesome. Perfect. You good with that? Yeah. All right, so check this out. Now that we've got these thoroughly mixed up, check this, that is crazy. So watch, I'm gonna deal them out. into piles of four, okay? Mm -hmm. Now check this out, this is so crazy. Now you cut the deck as many times as you want, right? Do me a favor, flip over that pile right there. Like the whole Yeah, thing? just all four of them right there. All four fives, all of the fours, all of the threes, mm -hmm. all of the twos, all of the aces, all of the kings. Every single card in its place See. How did you do that? It's crazy, right? I'll teach you the secret right now. You're going to need a brand new deck of cards and they need to be in new deck order. The beauty of this trick is that it's completely self-working. So you can cut the cards as many times as you want and then you're going to deal them into piles as if you are dealing them into ace through king. So 13 piles in total. Ace, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, jack, queen, king. And then we're just gonna repeat that process until we have four cards in every pile. So all you have to do is flip the cards over and they will be all sorted into matching sets of four just like this. So I've got a little spring here. Watch what happens when I concentrate on it. Check this out. This is a magic wire gram. This is nitinol wire and it's reactive to heat. This is the original shape that it comes in. We have these available now at EvaneraTV.com. It comes with everything you need to perform the trick. And we have them in a bunch of different shapes. This is the Jack of Spades. Head over to the link in the description at EvaneraTV.com or stay tuned for the end of the video to win one in the giveaway. All you're gonna do is unravel it. Now you can leave it in this stretched out state. Something that I like to do is coil it up around my finger and make it into kind of a spring. So you can then force that that card on someone, and then all you have to do is either drop this in hot water, wrap it in some flash paper, hold it over a candle, or apply heat in some other way. For instance, here's what you did not see in this performance, is a heat gun right below, and that is providing our heat source to heat up the nitinol wire so that it forms back into the shape of the selected card. Okay, I've got a really cool trick to show you with these markers. So check it out, I'm gonna take one of the markers and draw some shapes on this plate right here. I'm gonna draw like a little triangle, color it in, draw a square, over here and a circle right here. Now the shapes drawn on the plate, check this out. Watch, I take the water, slowly pour it on the plate and watch what happens. 
and the shapes magically float on the surface of the water. So cool. All right, here's how it's done. I'm about to reveal the secret. The secret to this trick is extremely simple and I'll teach you how it's done right now. All you're gonna need to do this at home is a plate, some dry erase markers, and some water. I've seen a lot of people do this in their kitchen sink or in their bathroom sink. I actually don't recommend that because depending on what type of sink you have, it can stain the sink. So it's best to do it on a ceramic plate like this. You can experiment with different colors yourself, but I've found that the best one is the Expo dry erase in purple. It lifts off every single time, but you do have to be careful and pour the water very slowly. So that it lifts off the Edge. And then as it keeps going up, it will continue to lift the rest of the image off. So you can do like a little stick man like this. You can do different shapes and then you can kind of bring them to light by making them float on the surface of the water like this. So cool. Watch, he's going to do some flips. So grab a plate, some markers, and some water and try this one out at home. And the cleanup is super easy. All you have to do is just take your finger like this. You can actually just pick them up just like that and throw it away. Okay, check this out. I have a water bottle full of water and I have a ketchup packet in the bottle. You can see it all the way at the bottom here. Now watch what happens. I can take the ketchup packet and cause it to magically rise inside the bottle. It floats all the way to the top. Now watch this. I can actually control it and make it sink all the way to the bottom again. It's completely under my control the entire time. You can make it rise, stop, and fall totally under your command and your control. I'll teach you the secret right now. You're going to need a packet of ketchup and a water bottle to pull this trick off. So really your first and only step in the setup is to take the packet of ketchup and submerge it down inside the water bottle just like this and then put the cap on. Now once loaded into the bottle, the ketchup packet is gonna wanna just naturally float like this. All you have to do to control its rise and its fall is squeeze the bottle. Gently squeeze the side and the ketchup packet will sink to the the bottom. Then when you're ready for it to rise, just simply let the pressure off and the packet will begin to float. So grab a bottle, a ketchup packet, and try it out at home. Alright guys, that is it for this video. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up button and share it with someone who you think might like it too. Sharing the video really helps the YouTube algorithm, helps more people see the video, and helps the channel grow. Please help us on that road to 3 million YouTube subscribers. We're almost there. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so you see all of our videos. And it is giveaway time. I'm giving away Magic Wire Grams. The cool trick that you saw in this video where the wire just magically forms itself into the shape of a card, you can win one for free. All you have to do is leave a comment down below and give the video a thumbs up. I'm going to go through the comments section, pick random comments, and mail the magic out to you. Special announcement. This is exclusive, so listen up. If you're not a member of our exclusive mailing list, be sure to sign up now. Head over to EvanerraTV.com. That's my online magic shop. You can find a ton of cool magic tricks there, but scroll all the way to the bottom of the page and you can find the sign up for our email list. There's almost 30,000 people subscribed to this email list already, so don't miss out. You get exclusive offers, free gifts, early access to new product releases before anyone else sees them. All you have to do is put in your email address and click submit to sign up for the email list. Time to announce the giveaway winners from our last how-to magic video. The winners are magically appearing on the screen right here. Congratulations to our winners. If you won that giveaway, be sure to send your full mailing address to this email address on the screen to claim your prize. Until next time, remember that anything is possible as long as you stay positive, work hard, and laugh at life. Love you guys.